To properly measure your head for a full hair system, you will need a tape measure, a pen, and paper. Start by holding measuring tape at your front hairline. Follow the hairline circumference around your head. Continue around head until you reach the front starting point. Record your results. Next, measure ear to ear. Establish your top of head point by measuring 7 inches back from the front hairline. This will indicate where the tape measure will pass across the head. Hold measuring tape at hairline at top of one ear. Guide measuring tape across the top of head point and continue down to your hairline at the bottom of the opposite ear. Record your results. Your last measurement is front to back. Hold measuring tape at your front hairline. Follow a straight line down the center of your head, ending at the hairline at the nape. Record your results. Once you are done, refer back to John Renault's sizing chart to determine your size. If your three measurements are not exactly matched to any one of the standard sizes, choose the wig size that is indicated by the largest measurement. To correctly put on a wig, you will need a wig liner. For those with existing hair, a fishnet wig liner works best. The opening will allow you to wrap and shape your hair flat against your head. Carefully pull the fishnet cap over your head so that it is around your neck. Pull the wig cap up with the elastic band on your hairline and the netting around your hair. Use one hand to wrap and shape your hair. Tie the opening to secure. If your wig features a welded lace front, be sure to set the liner back and away from your hairline so it does not show through. Turn your wig over and hold it in front of you. The hairline should be facing you. Put thumbs on elastic adjustable tabs at the nape and gently slip wig on like a cap, keeping your ears free. Push hairline of wig up to match with your natural hairline. Hold ear tabs and adjust placement to ensure wig is on securely. Do not pull or tug the lace front to adjust. Use wire and ear tabs to adjust and form to the shape of the temples. Use your fingers, brush, or a comb, depending on your fiber, to help shape into desired style. If you are wearing an HD style, remember only to use a wide tooth comb. For short existing hair, or for total hair loss, a nylon wig cap is recommended. Slide cap on and adjust placement. If your wig features a welded lace front, be sure you set the liner back and away from your hairline so it does not show through. Turn wig over and hold it in front of you. The hairline should be facing you. Put thumbs on elastic adjustable tabs at the nape and gently slip wig on like a cap, keeping your ears free. Push hairline of wig up to match with your natural hairline. Hold ear tabs and adjust placement to ensure wig is on securely. Do not pull or tug the lace front to adjust. Use wire in ear tabs to adjust and form to the shape of the temples. Use your fingers, brush, or comb depending on the fiber to help shape into desired style. If you are wearing an HD style, remember to only use a wide tooth comb. If you have a welded lace front wig, be sure not to pull or stretch the lace. Use ear tabs to adjust wig placement on the head. Oh, 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 oh,